With finals just a few weeks away, appointments for the Office of Counseling Services has been growing to an alarming rate. And many students are waiting days or even weeks to speak with a licensed counselor. People need to talk about things and sometimes it takes someone a lot of courage to go and get help and then they're like kind of defer them and be like, yeah, you, you want help, but it's going to be two to three weeks. You'll feel some type of way in the moment and then once three weeks comes, like you won't feel that way anymore. So then it kind of feels pointless, you know. This semester saw a 40% increase in appointments and the Office of Counseling Services has responded to those increased needs. You can imagine with a 40% increase in demand, uh, we are stretched thin for sure. And actually just recently, we, um, this week actually, we've added a, a new person that's going to be here at least until the end of the semester to help us uh, deal with some of the demands. In addition, Health Services has recently set up a 24-7 hotline for students with urgent needs. Uh, so this is a, a, a newer program that we uh, have um, and we are seeing an increase, but uh, truthfully I would, I would like it to be utilized more because I think it's something that really can be useful uh, for our campus. Students who wish to speak with a counselor can set up an appointment by going to MyQ, selecting Student Life, and filling out an application form. At this point in time, it is unclear whether wait times will shorten, but the Department of Health Services will do everything they can do to help. For Q30 News, I'm Dilma Bod.